Well, Grant, a 5-1 defeat here against Stockport County. Where do you want to start with that one? We didn't give ourselves a start. So you're asking me where I want to start with it. We didn't, we didn't give ourselves a chance to start. We, we didn't get going first 15, 20 minutes of the game. Um, and then we didn't get going at the start of the second half, conceding within a minute or two. Uh, the goals are really, really soft. Very soft from, from our opinion. They're, listen, they're a good team. Stockport, you know, they're top of the league. Um, but the three goals we've given them, two set players and uh, an own goal, has given us a, a huge task. You know, the, the, we wanted to try and start the second half well. We made changes just to try and freshen it up a little bit because I thought we looked lethargic and slow and we couldn't press. And the centre-halves kept step, stepping past us without any real reaction, which is really frustrating for me. Um, and then we give ourselves a absolute mountain to climb by conceding within, I don't know what it was, maybe 30 seconds a minute of the second half. Um, and the game is sort of away, you know, gone then. Um, well, it felt like it was going to go, you know, so um, I'm really frustrated and disappointed. I just felt we didn't, we didn't give ourselves any, any sort of chance to, to, to etch, you know, get our own plan in place. Um, haven't conceded so early. Um, the, the whole atmosphere was one of kind of shock. Uh, did, did you see this coming in any way? No, because look, it's look, it's been a theme this season, hasn't it? You know, we can be so good against Wigan in the second half last Tuesday night, and then we can drop to these levels. And I don't know why. I don't. I don't know why it is because you know we're. we're me and Cliff and the staff are questioning what was the week like. We felt the week was really good leading into this game, probably one of the best weeks we've had. Um, players coming back from fitness, the game on a Tuesday, we'd managed to get a bit of a, a breather into one or two on Monday and then we had a really good week, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday. Um, so it's just, I actually don't, don't know myself, I can't put my finger on why we look so lethargic and so slow and so slow out the blocks. Like we just, we just didn't give ourselves an opportunity today, you know, conceding the goals that we did. Um, and we looked a little bit toothless, so that's um, there's a lot for us to digest and look at in that game, and and hopefully uh, you know try and put it right on Tuesday. I think back to the Newport defeat, and there seemed to be redeeming features from that. But today's manner of defeat th does that concern you? I mean, you appreciate the, the top of the league and, and they're a good mm. side, a quality side, as you say, but the, the manner was was quite concerning. The manner of the goals that we can see is concerning. The manner of the goals, you know, for the three goals in the first half are really poor goals for us to concede. We knew that the, they, they leave two players in behind our three zonal players. We, we prepped the players on that during the week. Um, they scored two from it, Evans and, and Madden, just coming off and just heading it into the middle of the net. Um, so we don't win the duels on, on those. The, the second goal is just, we, we even give them a helping hand by heading into their own goal. Uh, and then the fourth goal is just like, you know, we, we have a kickoff, four or five our players run, don't get it, drops, switch, balls in behind us and again a cross comes into the box and it's a goal. So um, there's, there's, for us we have to sit and digest this, this that was just simply nowhere near the level of uh, level we want to try and get to. And, and the goals that we conceded today were, were really, really disappointing. And they seem to follow a, a similar kind of vain, don't they? The, the headed goals, deep cross to the back post and why, what can you do to, to eliminate that from your side's defending? We just have to keep working. Uh, that's all you can do. Keep keep working, keep showing the players, keep repetition, making sure we try and get it right. It's, you know, look, the quality, for them, they'll probably say quality goals, quality balls and well worked and, and free headers, but for, for us we have to defend it better, there's no question about that and we don't give ourselves any sort of hope and chance by doing that and it just looked like it knocked us big time once we conceded the, the second and the third came from that up also, so um, look, we showed a, bit of, a little bit more fight in the second half but we were always going to do that anyway given the fact that we're 3-0 down but still nowhere near to try and affect them um, you know, we just uh, for probably the whole of the first half, we never let a glove on them, anywhere near them. To be fair, they just kept stepping past us. They won every duel, they won every second ball. Um, every time they played in behind us, I thought Laffey was going to get in. So it was just, yeah, it was just miles away from from anywhere we need to be today. Four changes at the break didn't have the the time to to have its impact, did it? No, not when you can see straight away within 30, 40, 30 or forty seconds of the second half and. 
again, that's just a, a mindset thing. We, we felt, you know, the next goal was going to be really important. I said it to the players, the next goal is going to be important. Let's sure, make sure we get it and we can see within a minute um, or so. So it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a poor day for everyone connected to the football club and um, it's a hurtful defeat that. But, uh, you know, f my job now and, and the coaching staff job is to pick the players up. Oh get the players prepared, ready for Tuesday night. Just on, on the changes, we attempted after conceding three in the first half to have a, maybe we well, didn't do it, but we attempted to have a change at the back? Uh, no, not really. Um, <clears throat> I felt we just needed to be a bit more positive in our play at the, at the top end of the pitch. I felt everything everything was coming back to us. I think we, we didn't react quick enough. Um, I just felt, felt that might have given us a spark. Look, if the game had a went the way we thought it was going to be second half, maybe it could have been different, but for this, for us to concede in that in that 30, 30 seconds or a minute of the second half probably hurt the changes a little bit. Um, but I felt the changes did add a spark to us in the second half and a bit of freshness, you know, so um, that was a pleasing element of it, but it was a little too late for us. Um, we just didn't get, a, we didn't get going at all. Are you giving yourselves mountains to climb too often this season? I think it's about a dozen or so times that you've conceded three or more. I mean, you're an attacking manager, you're a kind of manager that would like to, you score three, we'll score four, but when that's not happening, it, it, it is hard, isn't it? Yeah, and that's just managing games, though. You know, it's... Um, players have got to recognise that in, in moments, uh, you know, if there's a bit of a spell or, or teams are coming against you, you know, maybe to flip one down the channel and, and get and play in their half a little bit. But that's just, that that comes with game management, understanding the game, understanding your own role. Um, but we're working with a group all the time, working to get to get better at those small gains and small margins, what I think can help us. The 5-0 the defeat to Morecambe felt like that was the, the bottom, you, you were quite forthright in what you were saying afterwards the, the lads are going to be in tomorrow what's going to be the reaction or your plans for the for the squad now our, our plans will stay in house you know that's um that's that the plans are i'm not going to come out here and, and tell you our plans just because we got defeated do you understand what i mean our plans are we will focus and prepare for for tuesday night like we always do in every game um you know, we we feel like we haven't we haven't turned up today. All of us, staff included, we just haven't turned up, and we've let everybody down. Um, and that's a really hurtful one. Are you starting to worry? Worry about? Well, ab about the season and how it's transpiring. You're Twenty second in, in League Two, and with a, a really big game on Tuesday, and then sort of next week. Listen, I just focus on the next game. That's all we can do. We let everybody else feel like that if that's if that's the case. But we can't feel like that. We have to we have to focus and prepare the team for for each game as they come. Um, obviously, our next game in the league is at Sutton, but we've got one before that at Bradford. Um, so we'll prepare the team as best we can for Tuesday night to try and get a, a response from today. That Sutton one though is is a big one, isn't it? Uh, look, it's, it's every game's big now. You know, there's 18 games left. Every game. It is big in, in their own right, so we want to pick up as many wins as we can from now to the end of the season, and uh, obviously that's the next one for us in the league. Uh, anything finally from you with regards to the fans today? No, look, our fans are, are brilliant. I've said that all the time. Um, I don't know if you're you are you fishing for something there, or are you asking? Absolutely me? not. No, right. um, just uh, you know, fans today. No, we'll, listen, our fans, our fans, our fans can, can they've got every right to be hurt, hurt today, and 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 can absolutely have a go at us and me and, and everybody 100% they pay their money I say that all the time when we lose um, we give the fans nothing today we give the fans nothing to, to cheer us about um, and I'm sure they'll be really disappointed just as I am you know and uh, for me I've got to sit and digest this and watch that back and, and, and pick the bones out of it to see where we go for, for Tuesday night